This is great, though. NASA is planning another moonshot, hmm. which excites me not at all. What do you mean? Well, we've done this, uh, I don't know, what, 50 years ago? Oh, I would have thought you liked this. <laughs> uh, it's, You're over it's it. Like, I, can, look, can we go somewhere else? We've already been to the moon. Let's Let's go a little bit further than that this time. We've been to the moon. Mm. How many trips? Like, I think <laughs> eight? Were there eight Apollo missions that made it to the moon? I believe so. And so 16 people, I think, have been to the moon. And now we're making a big deal out of the fact that we're going to launch an unmanned mission to the moon. Our first moon landing since the last Apollo mission in 1972. 1972! 50 that is years ago. Unbelievable. Isn't that crazy? Six missions have landed humans. Oh, six. Yeah. It's not eight. Okay, so 12 have been to the moon. Artemis 1 is an uncrewed test flight. The flight will feature the first blast off of the space launch system rocket, which will be the most powerful in the world. The rocket is scheduled to launch from Florida's Kennedy Space Center August 29th. This program kicked off in 2017. So far, it has only cost us about $40 billion. <laughs> What the original... Look this up. What was the original moonshot? What did that cost us? Because we just had an estimate that... I mean, we've blown way past the spending already for uh, every major program, I don't know, since the 60s, uh, combined, has been surpassed by Joe Biden's spending. Do you, does it? Yeah. Okay. I've got them. Okay. I've got the them. original moonshot. You have a guess? I don't. I no idea. Ten okay. ten billion. Okay. So here's here. I'm going to tell you the cost. Okay. And then I'm going to tell you what the inflation adjusted is. All right. And that number will be more <laughs> shocking. The gap between those numbers will be more shocking than than the cost here. Uh, Forty nine point four billion for the space program. Oh, okay. Between uh, just just to get to the moon, right? Okay. All right. And then adjusted for inflation, that would have. That forty nine billion would be forty eight or uh, four hundred and eighty two billion today. Almost oh my gosh! Ten times from the sixties till now, it's ten times the price. What were we just talking about before the show? Wow. It was like the fifty first anniversary of Nixon taking us off the gold standard. Yeah, right. And ta da! And boy, right. the promises Tricky Dick made during that mm. little speech. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh! That's when it all started to unravel. So anyway, there you go. Uh, so almost half a trillion dollars in inflation-adjusted money, <laughs> right? Yeah. And this is costing us $40 billion. All right, well, then that's a bargain. What the heck? Oh, well, hold on a second. <laughs> Don't a say that. bargain. No, I want to go back to your original premise. <laughs> $49.4 billion, <laughs> We got a man on the moon. On the moon, yeah. In a matter of just a few years. Right. We've spent right. $40 billion now. Yes, and, and we've got nothing for it. We got nothing to show for it. Elon Musk is doing more in space than NASA. Yes. So Artemis One is part of NASA's long-term Moon to Mars program. The agency hopes to send astronauts to our planetary neighbor. Get this. Mm. Oh no! Within twenty years, Pat, what happened to twenty twenty six? Right. This they is- they were saying. A few years ago, oh, yeah. we're going to Mars, and by 2026, we'll land a man on, on Mars. Yep. Now it's 20 years down the road? My gosh. This is just like the Unreal. World Trade Center, man. It, yes, it is. It's, it's we, there <coughs> yes, is, it is so much red tape, foot dragging, uninspired motivation. We have no leadership. Yep. And things take forever. They yep. cost so much more when... It, like I said, it's just like the World Trade Center rebuilding that. It's a different mm-hmm. time now, and mm-hmm. it's maddening. As we said at the time, the Empire State Building took 11 months to build. 11 months. The steel still warm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, when they were putting it up. Because <laughs> it had gotten to, from Pittsburgh to New York that quickly. That is awesome. And now, and the World Trade Center Tower took 11 years to finally get done. I mean, it's unbelievable. What you know? We're better than this. Mm-hmm. We're better than this. It's just amazing that we nobody has really given us that vision that hey, we're we're going to be explorers again, and we're going to get to Mars, 
And we're going to get Mars by 2030. We're going to do it in this decade. We could, we could do it as Americans. We did it in the 60s. We can't do it in the 2020s. It's crazy. That's just nuts.